It's a juicy crunch we can't wait to get a bite of. We're talking about apples this morning, and they're more than just a beautiful color. There is science going on behind the scenes there. And today we're joined by Jessica Wells, executive director for Crunch Time Apple Growers, to tell us about some delicious apples. So Jessica, what is Crunch Time Apple Growers? Crunch Time Apple Growers is an organization that was formed by a group of growers um, about 10 years ago. Um, in order to market fruit or mar market apple varieties that were developed by Cornell University. Cornell has a great apple breeding program um, led by Dr. Susan Brown. And this group of growers wanted to make sure that the apples that they develop um, actually get to market. Where are your growers? So right now, all of, all of our growers are in New York State. Um, we do have some direct market growers. So growers that grow, grow in direct market directly to consumers outside of New York State, including a couple in Ohio. Tell us about the varieties you grow. So we grow Snapdragon and Ruby Frost apples. Um, Snapdragon is the more appealing to the general population. It is um, sweet and crunchy and juicy, and that tends to appeal to most people who eat apples. Um, Ruby Frost, on the other side, is a little more tart, um, and it appeals to fewer people just to eat out of hand, but it's great for baking and cooking. Um, it doesn't brown, so it's great for like a charcuterie board. Um, and it also comes into the stores later. Snapdragon has been in stores since late September, and Ruby Frost is really coming into stores now. So what is Snapdragon's flavor profile? Um, we call it sweet with spice or a little hint of vanilla. It just really depends on the year what, what other notes you get, but it's not just straight sweet. There's a little there's a little bit more of a flavor behind it, which is really what makes it appealing. What are the best ways to enjoy a Snapdragon apple? Honestly, I just like to put it in my backpack and when I need a snack in the middle of the day, pull it out and take a bite. Um, or if you're out on a hike or you, you, um, you're a runner and you know it's great for eating, eating after a run or a workout or any of those things, it's, it's really just take a bite and enjoy the crunch and the juice. I know it's been a big year for Snapdragon. It was recently named the official apple of the Buffalo Bills. Can you tell us more about that partnership and what it means to crunch time apple growers? Sure. Um, as you know, we're primarily based in New York State, and the Bills are the New York football team. Um, even though we've got the New York Jets, the New York Giants, the Buffalo, the Buffalo Bills are really the only team that is based in New York State. So we thought it was a great partnership. Um, we're also located very close. Um, our main office, Crunch Time's main office, is in Lockport, which is just outside of Buffalo. Um, they are great community partners in general. I mean, just it, with the community of Buffalo and, and the Bills, they're great. Um, they work well together. Um, it's, and uh, we, just, we just like the organization. What have you heard people say about Snapdragon? Oh man, uh, customers, we get feedback from customers all the time that, you know, this is the best apple I've ever had. I love the juice. I just, I, I love this apple. You know, that's that's what we, we hear all the time. And we've gotten to hand out apples um, before Bill's games this year. And the first game people were like, what are you handing me? <laughs> Does it have alcohol in it? <laughs> and of course, no, it doesn't. But then the next game, they actually approached us. Do you have apples? Can you give us apples? People, once they try them, it's, they'll keep coming back to get them over and over again. Let's talk more about Ruby Frost. What's that flavor profile? The Ruby Frost flavor profile is a little less sweet. Um, it's, it is still sweet, it's just not that. It's, it's not that sweet, sweet that you get when you eat a Honeycrisp or a Snapdragon. Um, so that enables it to be used more for baking and cooking. What are the best ways to enjoy a Ruby Frost apple? One of my favorite ways to enjoy it is on a charcuterie board. You slice it up, put it out with um, some cheese and some crackers, um, nuts, whatever you put on your charcuterie board and just stack it up and eat it. Um, I like to put them on sandwiches, um, I in salads, uh, and then baking with them too. I, I will bake almost anything with a Ruby Frost. Well, where can we find Snapdragon apples? Snapdragon apples in your area are available at Costco, Walmart, Aldi, the Fresh Market, and then I believe there's a little IGA called Dillonville IGA that has has them as well. Um, Costco will also have Ruby Frost um, in the near future, probably around the 1st of February. 
Well, Jessica, thanks for talking with us today. Have a great day. Thank you, you too.